Hey everybody and welcome back to the Erin Space. My name is Erin and this is indeed and in fact my space on the internet. So thank you so much for being here and finding it. We are up at Universal Studios Hollywood tonight for a couple of reasons. Well, I just like coming up here. I pop up here as much as I can after work and it's a Wednesday night and I got off work and it's super sunny and nice out. So I came up here. We're here to try butterbeer ice cream at the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. And then I want to get an update. I'm trying to do weekly updates on the construction of the Fast and the Furious Universal Roller Coaster. It's going to be opening up here, I believe, in 2025. So I want to check out the construction. Anyway, thank you very much for being here. I really appreciate it. If you're enjoying watching these videos, maybe think about giving it a thumbs up. Helps the channel grow. We're so close to hitting our 500 subscriber mark. And I have fun stuff in store for y'all when we hit that. So thumbs it up. If you're really enjoying these videos, maybe think about sh subscribing. Cha-ching, cha-ching, cha-ching. Uh it's free, it's fun, it's easy. You'll get alerts whenever I put out my weird, wild, random, sometimes informative, hopefully funny and entertaining videos. But anyway, thanks for being here. I'm gonna go walk into the park and we're gonna go get some butter beer ice cream. Ah, oh, what a great day. You know what this face means? <laughs> we made it! We're in! Aww, so pretty at this time of day. And bonus, it's open till 9 o'clock. Let's go! What is this? Nighttime lights! Recommended viewing times. This way, right? 8.20 and 8.50. Oh, I don't know if I have it in me to stay that late, y'all. Well, that's cool. We'll see how the night treats us, but first, I do know I have it in me to go get some a butter beer ice cream. Here we go. Into Hogsmeade. Time for ice cream. Up at Universal Studios Hollywood in the Wizarding World of Harry Potter, we do in fact have ice, not only ice cream, butter beer soft serve ice cream. And it was so easy and cute. It was right in the candy shop. So right when you first come into the Wizarding World, like one of the first shops you hit on the left-hand side is the candy shop. If you go into the candy shop, there's a whole ice cream station set up now. And they had chocolate, vanilla, cones, cups, and butter beer ice cream. And you could get it in a regular cup or a souvenir cup. So of course your girl had to get it in the souvenir cup. It says the Wizarding World of Harry Potter on the back. Right there. Can you see it? Can you see it? I can see it. But anyway, yeah, it was super cute. I haven't tasted it yet, but I'm assuming it's gonna be delicious, so I was just about to say highly recommend, but let me taste it first. This cup is adorable, too. It's really cute, the detailing on it. It's a chalice filled with butterbeer ice cream. But yeah, it's in the candy shop. It's super cool. I'm gonna taste it right now and see if it lives up to the hype I've built up in my head. All right, first bite on camera this time. I'm also back in my little nookie alcove area of the Hogsmeade's three broomsticks. But I'll, last time all you could hear was the Simpsons music. I think I'm sitting a little bit farther away so you can hopefully just hear me in the nice dulcet tunes of Harry Potter music. Butterbeer ice cream. Oh, let's go. Wow. Oh my God. Oh. Oh my God. Dude. It's delicious. The soft serve vanilla ice cream, even on its own. If you're ever craving soft serve ice cream, which I tend to crave on the reg, I would come here and just get this vanilla. But the butter beer swirled in, it's like caramel, butterscotch, shortbread. It tastes like butter beer swirled into vanilla ice cream. This may be my new favorite thing of all time. I'm no joke. But I also just love a Dairy Queen vanilla, and that's what this reminds me of, Dairy Queen vanilla. But with butterbeer flavoring strewed throughout. Mm -hmm. 10 out of 5. When you're up here, come, go to the candy shop, and get yourself a soft serve butterbeer ice cream. Honestly, you will not regret. It is delicious. Butterbeer ice cream for dinner? Yes and thank you. Please and thank you. Exit is coming up from the downstairs elevators right there. now. He's gonna call him when he gets, gets there. there. Okay. Let's see what's happening here though. 
Uh, looks kind of the same. It'll be interesting. So I'm gonna try to do these weekly if I can. It'll be interesting to see when like stuff starts getting laid down. Some like numbers on the woods part up there. But it kind of still looks the same from last week. We got the tarps down here. This is the first layer. Got the dirt going. We got these guys just hanging out, ready to go. Got another gorgeous sunsetty vibe going on up here. But yeah, okay, so this is level one. Kind of looking the same. I can't wait to see that movie. Level one, looking the same. A lot of earth movement. No metal structures for tracks yet though. Let's take uh, a little bit further walk that way and see what the second layer is looking like, shall we? Okay, second level. So we were just looking up there, and now we're looking down here. Looks like it's gonna be a straightaway. That looks like they've cleared more dirt and flattened it since last week. You have to compare and contrast as the year goes by. Oh, look at that, they're building right on top of Dracula. That's kind of cool. We got some porta potties set up over here too for the crew, I'm sure. But yeah, got a little upstairs, downstairs. I am so stoked that they have to build this roller coaster pretty much in view of everyone. So throughout the year, we're going to be able to come up here and really see it getting built. I'm wildly excited about that. But yeah, it's going to be awesome. That part right there, right? That's, that's going to be a straightaway. They're gonna jump levels. Oh, I cannot wait. Okay, update for today done. Let's continue down. Oh, it's a rowdy crowd up here tonight, but I'm, I'm cool with that. Oh my god, I am also ridiculously excited. Not for the wild robot, I'm sure it's gonna be lovely, but for Twisters. Twister in like the 90s, like I could not get enough of that movie. I was obsessed. Yes, yes, the Helen Hunt. Bill Paxton movie, Twister. And I love that they just put an S on the end. Called it Twisters. Sign me up. In theaters July 19th? Yeah, I'll be there. On July 19th. In IMAX, baby! Almost to the lower lot. Holy guacamole. Like, literally, the sky is crazy cool looking. Just chilling in front of the raptor encounter here. So when I confirmed that this park closed at 9, really, it kind of threw me for a loop. And then I felt like I had all the options. I went from having none of the options to all of the options. So we could have seen a Waterworld show at seven o'clock. We could have even done the last studio tour tram ride at 7.15, but I kind of wanted to just roam and walk around. I couldn't even finish. I didn't finish all of my ice cream. I scooped out the last couple of bites and then washed out the cup. Oh, splash down. But it's so good, it was so good. But yeah, we if they stay up until nine o'clock, Hopefully they're gonna start doing this. I know it's probably for spring break, but I hope they start working in more summer hours throughout the week, because it's just so cool. Like last week at this time, we were jumping on the Jurassic World ride and then running out of the park, because they closed at seven and it's seven o'clock right now. But now, we're kind of just chilling and walking around. But it did kind of throw me for a loop. I, so like I said, I didn't do Waterworld and I also did not do the studio tram. Kind of wanted to walk around, wanted to check out the construction, but I also want to go into, I haven't been in it in a while, I'm gonna go into um, Super Nintendo World. So let's go pop over there. We're on the lower lot, we've made it down. A lot of people were leaving, so hopefully Super Nintendo Land won't even be that crowded either. We might try to ride Bowser's, we'll see, we'll see. Let's just get over there. But yeah, Universal, Wednesday night, keeping it open till nine. Let's do My battery died, but that's okay. We're gonna make our way over to Super Nintendo World. Um, I, while I did love having my butter beer, soft serve, and all ice cream for dinner, I might try to pick up something savory in there. Maybe we can even get into toadstools. The, this is literally like we have so many options because it's open till nine o'clock. But let's just go, let's keep it cool. Let's keep it chill. Let's go see if we can get in there and maybe get a savory snack and do some one up and do 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 do. Oh my God. I love a Transformers meet and greet. <laughs> Look at Bumblebee! <laughs> I think we made eye contact. Ooh, he's playing music! <laughs> Appropriately placed right outside the Transformers the Ride 3D. And then right to the left of that. Oh, Bumblebee's popping off. Super Nintendo World! Let's see if we can get in. Old Sioux Cafe is fully booked, not shocked, but we can still go into the land. Look how pretty. 
Let's go through the warp pipe. And get some one-ups to end this Wednesday. all the people. Wait 10, 95 minutes for Bowser. Yeah, we're not waiting. I love this ride, but not 95 minutes worth. Look how cool it is in here though. Ah, love it, love it, love it. Luigi and Mario. Just checking out the store here for any new merch. I did see the gold one year anniversary one-up bands but they were also $52, so I think I'll be sticking with my OG Mr. Toad one up. I'm very happy with him. Here he is, Toad. Look at this guy. Could you not love Toad? Hello, Toad. <laughs> oh my God, I just freaked out so hard. I literally met Toad. I don't know if I recorded because he came out. We all started chanting, Toad, 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 and clapping and applauding him. I don't know, I filmed it, I didn't film it. I'm not sure what happened. I just met Toad. Recorded any of that, I freaked out. We can't touch his head, of course not. That's where he gets all his power from. We don't touch his head or walk behind him. Oh my god, he's so cute. Stop. Oh my god, it's happening. Hi, Toad. I'm very excited to meet you. Hi. Safety of our guests. Stay right where you are. Let's give her some space. She's right now testing out spatial parameters. That's all she's doing. It's part of the exercise. Right now, we have a situation that I have not seen before. We have a dog drinking water. Or is that a pop cup? It's ice cream. All right. Lou is right now observing the dog eating ice cream. Nothing phases this dog. I'm not sure who's braver, who or this dog. She loves dinosaurs. Interesting. Okay. And we try to teach some of our dinosaurs similar techniques that would be for a dog, except we do not. Let's open up the line again. We do not teach tricks to. Hello. Where are you from? Burbank. Okay, you've Hello. come a long way. I see you wearing way. a DNA hat. Yes, my What's DNA, DNA hat. hat. What is DNA? Dibronucleotides. I don't know about Dionucleotides. Dionucleotides. All right. Don't tell Professor Alan Grant. Don't tell Alan. Holy cow, what a night up at Universal Studios Hollywood. Kind of like chilling in the little plaza area here now. But after I lost my actual mind when I met Toad, I walked out of Super Nintendo Land and I got to meet a Velociraptor. And I, I, the guy, the trainer, the guy, the trainer, asked me about my hat. He goes, you're wearing a DNA hat. What does DNA stand for? And I could not for the life of me remember. So that was an embarrassing moment in front of Blue, the Velociraptor. But holy cow, 
what a great time. This was so much fun. We got to see the construction updates. We got to have butterbeer ice cream for dinner. We got to meet Toad. We got to meet Blue. I didn't even go on any rides. I was just up here chilling and meeting people. But sometimes on a Wednesday night, you gotta do that. So thank you so much for being here. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you did, maybe give it a thumbs up. Maybe give it a choo -choo 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 -choo, subscribe. And uh, I'll catch you around. I'm gonna be making a lot of these. So thanks for watching. And as always, I'll catch you in the air and space. Bye! I'm so ashamed I didn't know DNA.